Hi, this is Phil Hinton. Welcome back to CES 2010. Lots of talk on the show floor of 3D TV, but as we all know, you have to wear 3D glasses. Well, I'm with Danny from uh, TCL, TCL, and uh, Danny, we're looking at a 3D TV behind us, yes. and we don't need glasses. Tell us about it. Sure. Now, in fact, this is our own proprietary technology. It's from our own research. Usually, you, you need to wear glasses, what we call a, a rectangular. Well, in fact, we build a rectangular on the screen itself. What you're seeing is a normal television. However, instead of wearing a spectacle, the glasses, the rectangular is on the LCD. So the rectangular on the LCD create the different splitting images. And then uh, it, that's one part of the equation. The other part is the software. And then the content originally is only 2D. We done a 3D conversion from the 2D. And when this to add up, it gives you the experience, the effect of, um, you don't need a spectacle of the 3D experience. That's what you see, it speaks for itself. Now, is, is this compatible with what we see already on Blu-ray 3D, which is coming from other companies like Panasonic and Sony and so on? Is it compatible with this TV? Now, put it this way, we plan in about 12 to 18 months time to, to, to be able to launch in the consumer market. So in theory, whatever 2D content should be able to convert into 3D dimensions. And through this device, you're able, the consumer is able to enjoy a 3D experience. Now we've seen this before, uh, but it's all, all been done with the viewing angles, you know, being off access and so on. Now if I sit off to the side, do I still get the same effect? Now, we have a better, wider viewing angle. You can experience yourself, you can move across. If I just count it, I think we have more than eight viewing angles that the user do not need to stand in the direct right angle spot. You're able to go around and you're still able to see the 3D experience. And at the moment, this is more than a commercial use for advertising, to stand out the product for advertising. But uh, I think for commercial, let's say for consumer market, we're looking at something like 24 months down the road. So 24 months possibly for a consumer launch. How would that be done in Europe then? Who, who would launch that in Europe? Now we are working with uh, strategic partners and definitely uh, we, we would be open to, to, to with, uh, with uh, anybody, let's say all the big boys in the industry or even launch ourselves. And uh, we like to, uh, we like to share the experience to bring this 3D experience to the consumer in Europe. For example, majority of UK, Germany, France, I think over there, you know, you don't need to wear glasses anymore and you can have a 3D experience at home. Well, it's fascinating to see. Thank you very much for your time, Danny. Good no to problem. see you. Thank Best you. of luck for the rest of the show. Thank you. Hope you have a good show. Thank you so much.